Today we're going to be making uh, Parmesan Madeleines. So these are a nice little starter um, that you can make for your guests when they arrive and have with a glass of something sparkling. So let's give them a go. So I'm going to start. Okay, so I'm going to start off with uh, preparing my um, well my Madeleine tray. If you're like me and you don't have a Madeleine tray, but you've got something that's a very shallow kind of um, uh, bun tray, then uh, this works. This works really good. So we're going to um, uh, just basically butter up <laughs> the, uh, uh, the tray and then we are going to then dust it with a little bit of uh, flour. So when you're quite happy that you've got everything um, uh, greased up, um, I'm then going to uh, put some uh, flour in here and then uh, the idea behind this is it's just going to stop the um, uh, the madeleines when they cook from sticking to the pan and then when uh, when you're quite happy that you've got all the flour everywhere then we'll just uh, uh, empty the excess okay so now I'm ready just to uh, um, knock out all the excess Okay, so I've knocked off most of it and uh, that's looking pretty good now. Okay, and the next stage is to uh, um, just whisk in my sugar and my eggs. So I've got me uh, 10 grams of caster sugar there and then I'll just, uh, just give them a whisk. Okay, so that's looking okay. We are just whisking it and just getting it to combine. We don't need it to get all fluffy and everything like that. But the next thing we do is we get our butter and we're just going to melt that butter. I'm just going to do that in the microwave. I'm just going to microwave it for about 10 seconds, check on it, stir it, another 10 seconds, stir it again. Okay, so I've got my melted butter. I'm just going to pour that in there and then just whisk this in. And then I've got my... Uh, I've got my natural yogurt. I'm just going to put that in there as well. Make sure it just all gets combined. Okay, so that's nice and smooth. Now, what I've got here is my um, baking powder and my garlic powder. I'm just going to put them into the um, uh, into the flour, and I'm just going to stir these up just a little bit and just try and get it uh, mixed in. Um, Sorry, we're going to add this to the uh, um, the the eggs, but I'm I'm not going to use the whisker anymore. I'm just going to do the next bit by hand. Okay, so put the dry ingredients in there. Just start stirring that through. Okay, and then I'm going to put my Parmesan cheese in. smell is amazing and as you can see that the uh, the mixture is quite sloppy all the more reason for making sure that we powder those um uh, those uh, madeline cases bun cases okay so the next bit is uh, uh putting the uh the mixture into the uh, the molds so i'm just going to get a couple of spoons and Ideally, they shouldn't go over the edges because that's where we're going to get the uh, the ingredients sticking. But um, we're just doing our best here, aren't we? Okay, I think I have quite enough to uh, um, do 12. Maybe if I'd have uh, evened this up a little bit with uh, not being too generous for the first ones, I might have been able to. But uh, now what we'll do is we'll put these into an oven about 200 degrees um, and uh, for about 15 minutes. But let's check on them after 10 and uh, yeah, see how we go. So what are we going to serve with this? So it's like a canapé or a hors d'oeuvre or something like that. So you meet and greet and have these while you're chitting and chatting. So I am going for a sparkling French white. So it's not a champagne, but this particular one, it's, uh, by, um, it's a brand called uh, Mademoiselle uh, Marguerite. Uh, she was a 
female pioneer in the white sparkling wine in the 40s. Um, but uh, it's excellent fresh wine, um, excellent standard, but you just don't have the same price tag as with it being the champagne. So I would go for a French sparkling to serve with these. Okay, so I've just chopped up my parsley and my garlic and I put the butter in there. And what I'm gonna do is again, I'm just gonna microwave this uh, like 10 seconds, check on it, 10 seconds, check on it until it's melted. And then we're gonna paint the madelins. Okay, so it's been in a microwave. Let's just paint these. And I'm just gonna put these back in the oven just for 30 seconds. <laughs> 